welcome to another video tutorial. Today I'm going to talk about lighting. I'm going to create a lighting system for an interior scene and I'm going to show you Corona Interactive Lighting. If you are new on this channel, I'm creating 3D architectural visualization tutorials and some tips and tricks. Please check my other videos. So, let's start our tutorial. You know, there are so many different light systems such as sun, sky or any other lights. In this scene, there is no light right now. If you click the Start Interactive button, you will see a black render image. Ok, let's stop this. I always use Override Material method to check the lighting much better. To do that, let's create our Override Material. First, we need to open Material Editor and then right click, choose Material, Corona and Corona Material and then open Render Setup menu, click Material Override checkbox and add your Override Material here, should be Instance and click OK. Alright, now all scene has grey Override Material, but we need to exclude the glass because the light needs to come from outside. First, choose glass and click plus button. As you can see, it says one object excluded. Simply close those menus and open environment and effects menu. There is nothing in environment map. So, click none button and add corner sky there. Simply close it and start interactive one more time. Awesome! The skylight coming through from outside. Let's make some little post settings to get clear render now. Make exposure to 0, highlight to 10, and contrast to 1. No need any saturation here right now. Ok, our render looks much better now. As you can see, there is a bluish color now, because of sky is blue, and blue color is coming from outside. Ok, let's continue, let's continue to our tutorial. Let's add two hidden lights to the ceiling. Move to the top view with pressing T from keyboard and create two coronal lights. Make sure the light shape is rectangle, drag a rectangle shape and move this up. And change the name to hidden light. Simply copy that light with pressing shift and move the light. And create the second hidden light. And don't forget to check instance. Ok, let's change the light settings. Choose direct input for color, because now I wanna see a white color. Let's start interactive one more time. Looks great! Our scene is improving. Let's add other two ceiling lights. Move back to the top view and create two more coronal lights. But at this time, make sure the shape is sphere. First, create the light and move up to the inside of the light cover. For these lights, I'm going to use IES lights. Simply click none button and choose real IS bolt file. As you can see, the light shape is changed. Simply clone this light with instance clone and change the name to ceiling light. You know what? The changing name is really important thing. Because if your scene has too many lights, it will easy to arrange all the lighting in the light mix menu. Alright, let's choose again our camera with C from keyboard and click start interactive button. I think we need to reduce the light intensity from 25 to 2500. Let's make depth of field settings for our camera. Ok, I think our basic lighting setup is completed. Now, let's set up the light mix and play the color of the lights. To do that, open render setup and click set up light mix button and then click generate. That's it. It's really easy like that. Click start interactive button again and now you will see light mix up there. You can easily change all lights from here. You can turn off or on the lights 
and you can change light power and light color. Let's play a little bit. Okay, now uncheck the Overwrite Material and see our final render. Simply click Overwrite Material checkbox and start interactive again. Okay, now you can make your final light settings from Light Mix tab while rendering. Finally, make the final post settings such as contrast, vignetting, etc. Okay, I think I am done with this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed that. If you liked the video, please don't forget to click the like button and also please subscribe for more. See you on the next video.